and said, we agree. 56% of children were born with birth defects in this community, and we even agree with you what types of birth defects those children had. However, we do not believe it's related to Love Canal, the 20,000 tons of chemicals there. We believe it's related to a random clustering of genetically defective people. <laughs> and anybody who took stats knows that there is that possibility of being one in a trillion. I don't know what the numbers are, but there, there is that possibility. Science is really important. We need to find the science. We need to, we need to keep up on it, whoever's doing it. The research, the stuff that Teresa does for, for the groups that she works with through CHEJ, but what, whoever does it here. Science is not going to set you free. It's not going to win the day. It's just a, a tool in a toolbox. It's a screwdriver, right? It's not the hammer that's going to change it. It's a screwdriver. So you can screw all day. <laughs> but it ain't ever going to set you free. <laughs> so the other thing we looked at was legal. And other people have looked at legal. And you already know this. God knows you know this. That it's perfectly illegal what these idiots are doing. <clears throat> there is no laws that we can really wrap our hands around as it relates to injection wells and uh, extraction wells. I mean, there's a few here and there, but there's nothing that we could really wrap our arms around. The law was written by them. It was written by Hal Burton. Mm -hmm. So that Hal Burton can do exactly what they're doing. Yeah. It's not against the law. So the way to beat them, so at Love Canal, it was the same thing. It was, it was um, there is actually a number where you get a permit to pollute. And it's essentially permission to kill a certain number of people. A permit generally says one in a million or one in 10,000 or one in 100,000. They have different numbers for different areas and stuff that that many people could be harmed by your discharge. Right. Wow. Is that yeah. a federal law? It's in every permit. It's in every permit. It's disguised. It's like you can't, what is it in Ohio, Teresa? Pardon me? What is the air permit in Ohio? One in 10,000? One in 10,000 people can die from that flare by the mobile park. Legally get cancer and die. Lois, the flare is not permitted. They do not permit flares in the state of Ohio. So it's one in 10. Yeah. Well, that's the law. Yeah. Okay, so y'all can die. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
one last piece and then we'll open the floor and I'll answer any questions or we can go down this path or down a different one. One of the keys to um, talking to people and getting them involved, because you need people involved, is to talk about your messages. So, what is your message? And I was looking, I was taking 